So if you're already watching this, you really are doing um, yourself a great advantage in making sure that you not only have a, a well or an adequate senior year, but you want to have the best senior year in regards to academics, social life, anything like that. Um, I'm definitely a really uh, knowledgeable person. Um, I actually write for a local magazine in my area and I give advice to teenagers and I'm also an intern for Congressman Ted Deutsch so that kind of gives me definitely a lot of um, insight and in what like teens uh, kind of navigate through when they're in their senior year and I will also be taking these tips and using them on my own because I am going into my senior year this year, so next month I'll officially be a senior in high school, so I'm going to take these tips along with you. Tip number one is to start a senior bucket list. Make a list of everything that you want to do in regards to uh, maybe you want to get a charity honor roll or you want to get um, just an honor roll, you want to be in the top 10%, you want to be valedictorian, salutatorian, anything like that. Um, or even like you want to be more social, you want to go to parties, tailgates, football games, anything like that. Um, make a list of it because during your senior year, I can guarantee you we will be swamped in college applications and waiting for uh, approval or decision or in my case offers um, for UK universities. So just make a list of everything like that you'll end up being much more prepared tip number two is to uh, make sure you're keeping your grades up i know as soon as you get accepted depending on when you're applying um like early decision early action a lot of seniors kind of like slack and get senioritis um and they just kind of don't really have the motivation to keep up good grades but that can definitely damage your gpa and in even certain cases colleges will um, resend their offer because you're not keeping up academically as you were when you applied so make sure you're keeping that same um, pace and if there is a problem contact the university and have that conversation with them tip number three is to try to take pictures of everything um really make sure that you kind of document every single thing that's important um i'm actually uh in the process of filming my own college reactions video which i know people watching this are gonna be like i watched those videos i was just watching one before i filmed this so i'm literally just always watching those um and filming my own is, is really cool and kind of filming my uh, college application process because it is so different and I am going to college in um, England so it's it's completely different so documenting that is really helpful and it's really just a nice way to have something to look back on. Tip number four is to decide uh, what you're going to do when you are graduating so in that case if you want to be in um, a certain rank if you want to be in like the top 10 or want to become valedictorian really make sure to work on that in the beginning of senior year so you already have that like nailed down um so you can speak at graduation thank you so much for watching you have reached the end of this video make sure to subscribe to college express comment down below if you use any of these tips and i will see you guys next time on this channel bye guys